you know, that anticipating oh, yeah. waiting to watch that Masters, whether it's the U.S. Open, you know, some of the That's other tournaments, really- you know, you catch them on Sundays, but those big ones, the yeah. U.S. Open, the Masters, you know, those kind of things. Um, you know, that's part oh, of you your put year. The master, you, know? you put the masters up on your computer at work, just yeah, just to watch yep. it. You know, just to see no. that. Screen. How much revenue has been is lost with sports not happening right now? If Ooh. you took all the sports combined, you know, if you want to just talk the masters alone, right? Okay, that's huge. Um, NHL not playing, NBA not. March Madness. March Madness is a huge fucking money maker for all the television rights. Um, you know the the basketball ticket sales obviously uh i mean that's i couldn't even fathom how many billions of dollars have been um lost to these organizations by not having these events what do you think pete you yeah i mean for me i obviously agree with each of you i i can relate to everything you guys are saying um you know personally i stopped watching porn Basically, pro sports in 99. Um, I continued playing until 2005, but I stopped watching well earlier than that. And, um, you know, it wasn't until recent that I actually started watching again. And so, you know, this this pause for me has, has really, you know, showed me how much I really appreciate being able to get back into it. Um, it's hard to put into words, you know, because it's in some ways has, has saved me. Um, you know, I, I have buried my life in, in work and I stopped watching pro sports for a, at least a decade. And so, you know, now it really hits home, um, you know, not having this. So it, it has truly been a saving grace to be able to continue every Wednesday, you know, having these conversations with you. It's really... yeah. It's been helpful. Yeah, boys, good around the rink tonight, man. Uh, another four topics uh, we went through tonight. We'll keep doing that throughout the podcast. Just kind of banter four different things throughout the season, um, off season, what's going on. Obviously, we're in a weird time right now, uh, but we're going to keep plugging away at the Blue Line Hockey Club. Uh, get you guys some good interviews. That obviously, you want to hear from these NHLers like Greenway and Hartman and um, some of our future guests that are coming up. So at least you'll get a little bit of uh, sports through us at the Blue Line Hockey Club. So keep listening to us. Check us out on Twitter, um, YouTube, Facebook, all of the social media. But one of the big things that we do now is we put this podcast out on our YouTube channel. And, um, you know, if you're sick of listening to podcasts, check out our YouTube channel and you can watch it instead. So a little bit more uh, interactive to see our faces and um, see what we're doing throughout the show. And uh, the Jordan Greenway podcast, uh, you'll be able to see him live on the podcast too. So that was a, that was nice of him to come on with a video tonight. So check out our YouTube right. channel. I, got my, I had my shirt off tonight too, so check that out. Yep. Full out man Either. boobs tonight. So if you like man boobs, check it out. All right, boys, another great episode of Blue Line Hockey Club. That was 94. Check out the other 93 on bluelinehockeyclub.com. And until next time, keep your stick on the ice. Tell ya! Here we go! Oh, doctor. Yeah. Keep your head up.